What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to another video. You might be wondering why I have these two cameras set up, and that's because, um, sorry, I keep freaking off to look at that. Um, I asked my members, which you can become a member down below, ask me a couple questions. I might do a QA, just just ask around. And I got I got many questions. I'm not gonna lie, more than I expected. Now, if I do another one, you can go ahead and leave your comments down below questions that I might answer in the comments or in another Q&A. The first question that I see on here is guy, but on YouTube, who inspired you to start YouTube? That's a really hard one. I don't know if anyone in specific inspired me to start YouTube, but I mean, Minecraft YouTubers was like pressed in plays and stuff. That's, that's what I started out playing on YouTube. There weren't really any like main contributors to me starting YouTube because I've been doing YouTube for nearly a decade now. And that's something that that's, that's not something that I ever thought I would say. One of the main contributions to me doing YouTube is probably my cousins my brother because if you don't know the original name of this channel was lunatic gamer actually let me pull up uh a video that i made a very long time ago the intro for youtube this is it this is what i made it's privated now this is what i made it has 17 views i was lunatic gamer spelled like that not actually lunatic it's just spelled like that it's a real goose says where did you get the idea for your youtube name um where did i get the idea for my youtube name this one's actually a pretty easy answer me and my brother shared a minecraft account because you know we shared a computer back in the day we combined our names and it became Grazeland. of course i don't think it was said like that our mom was making the account for us she just wanted to make sure we were both happy so both of our names were inside of it but it also goes along with my name a lot more than his because it's gray's land so it's my land it works perfect come on come on this is an iconic username okay you, you would see this and you'd be like oh that's my guy zockerboy 747 says how rich are you To be honest, all the stuff you see that I have is all from birthdays over the years. Everything that I've gotten is from birthdays and Christmas. This has just been building up. I mean, this whole rack of stuff over there, that's all been built up over like seven years. I'm not rich at all. My first paycheck hasn't even come in and I'm not even getting my March money. Where do you life? Question mark. Only country. The United States. The cool student from Baldi says, why did you want to upload Baldi's Basics Plus content? To be honest, I just remember playing Baldi's a long time ago and I heard that there was a new character like months before it came out. I even mentioned it in the first video. I just uploaded it because I thought it would be fun. And you know, it was fun. And I got a lot of views from it. Halfstead Homo says, if Baldi was standing right next to you, what would you do? What caused you to live stream Baldi's Basics Plus? I don't know. It's it's an easy way to start growing your channel, live streaming stuff and making videos. It's just something that I feel like is is what a lot of people do, you know. Uh, I started live streaming because it's also one of the easiest ways for me to start growing and actually gaining money from YouTube to make this a job. Who is your favorite Baldi's character? Says Baldi1999. My favorite Baldi character is probably Dr. Reflex or Beans. You can probably tell because they're the ones that are in my thumbnails the most. Type Shalols said, What type of Baldi mods are you thinking of playing? I just kind of go on Game Banana and search for a mod and I instantly make a video on it. I have a Google Doc filled with a ton of ideas and people always claim that they've, they're the ones that made the challenge, like they commented it. I'm sorry you didn't make it i have google doc i have names of videos listed and then i just go and pick whichever one looks the most fun during that day radio tower e says what's your favorite game minus baldi's basic sorry to tell you baldi's basics is not my favorite game so if you asked me that i would have not have said baldi's basics 
I would probably have to go with Terraria or Minecraft. I love the sandbox games and I love how much fun they are. You know, I like being able to beat the game, play the game however I want, even add mods and just do it the way I want to. Uh, I've played a lot of Gmod, uh, a lot of Spore. Spore is one of my all time favorites and Cuphead. I was actually planning on making a Cuphead video really recently and it might still be coming out. Rebecca Finlayson says, what's your most clutch moment in Baldi's Basics? I was preparing for this moment. So my most clutch moment actually takes place in my second Baldi's Basics video. Dr. Reflex makes Baldi's Basics impossible. Uh, of course, it's the most viewed part because it's, it's the most insane. My grappling hook completely used. I was I'm Shut all the, the way across the map. I use Baldi's least favorite tape, and here I am with nothing. I'm walking through a foggy area with nothing. This is basically just me trying to survive, and oh, I, still far to go. I love, I love this video. This is genuinely one of the best videos. This is still one of the most insane things. You can hear Baldi coming, so I start running the other direction. Pauses. And he is right there. I seriously don't know what God was watching over me that day because I should have gotten killed. I'm not going to lie. I should not have been able to have that cool clutch moment because I should have just died. I'd have to go back and look at a lot of my clutch moments for this game because there's like 30 videos now. Last comment by Todd Talks Real. Where do you see your channel in five years? Very interesting that you ask that, Todd, because I don't know. What have most of these questions been about? Baldi's Basics. They've all been about Baldi's Basics. I've been doing YouTube for a consecutive nine years, and let me just tell you, only this year have I gotten this 10,000 subscribers mark. I have surpassed 10,000 subscribers in the last year. In the last two months, I have gotten more subscribers than I've had for the past nine years. What I... You're asking me what I am going to be doing. I'm still going to be making YouTube videos. Don't doubt that. But do I know if they're going to be like they are right now? No, I don't know. I don't know at all because it all depends on if I can make this a stable career. Where do I see my channel in five years? Hopefully still making videos for you guys. On Baldi's Basics? I don't really hope so. I love this game, and I hope it keeps getting updated past 1.0. But apparently 1.0 is going to be the last update. So in five years, I don't know where I'm going to be. And that's all up to you guys sharing my content and supporting me throughout every single video I make. Your support goes a long way, and I really appreciate it. Have I talked about something with you? Did you know you could become a member of this channel? Well, I don't think you do. Becoming a member of this channel actually allows you to get videos early. This video came out early, and guess what? It came out a whole day early. Some come out weeks in advance. Haven't, hasn't happened yet, but guess what? If I stream, you might have members only chats. And guess what? You have priority comment replies. So that means if you ask me a question and you are a member, I'm probably gonna reply to you. Even if you're just joining live streams and someone gifts memberships for a donation, you have a chance to become a member. So I highly recommend coming and joining live streams just for fun. Telling your friends about subscriptions is also a great way to interact with the community. And guess what? I think you should click the subscribe button down below. It might have just flashed rainbow for you. You might want to rewind and check that. I don't know. I don't know how it works. But other than that, um, you get free emojis if I didn't say that already. Um, there might be members only videos. I haven't done that yet. Uh, there's stuff like right now. I do Q&A stuff and you're able to ask a question. And I instantly ask it in this video. Give you a little shout out too. Uh, you get shout outs in live streams and videos. That's a big one. You get a whole shout out at the end of my live streams. And in some videos, you'll get a shout out in the comments or even in the video like I'm about to do. Thank you, Vivid Dermatic, for becoming the highest tier member. I really appreciate it. 
all of your guys' support means a lot. I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye, everybody. Ciao.